boys and girls. It's story time with teacher Brenda. And today, I am just so excited to introduce to you my little friend, Bastian. This is Bastian, and he loves making a mess in the kitchen. Today, he's making his own special creation for his family. Look, he seems to be very busy. Hmm, what do you think will he prepare for his family? Let's find out in the story, Bastian's Apple Salad, written by Jade Mater. Let's begin. Bastian loves cooking. There's nothing he won't make. He whips up cereal al dente, and egg and orange cake, battered yogurt, chocolate studded ham, and cured cheese. Julienne bananas, pancakes, pan fried sausages, if you please. And when avocados are going old, he whips up guacamole. When tomatoes come back from the shop, they're suddenly salad. Holy moly! Impossible to have a kitchen even slightly tidy looking. His parents moan and groan because he's always, always cooking. And one day after school, Bastian announces with delight, It's time for apple salad, guys. Just wait till you have a bite. Into the sink, the apples go, all 142 of them. He chops into a stack of them and peels only a few of them. Some are cored and others diced and others made all twirly. He throws his head back with delight. Just wait till you try them curly, he says. Into the bowls, the apple go, cut every which way what. He drizzles apple juice over them, and then he serves them hot. Mom, Dad, Nan, and both the brothers try the new delight. What do you think? Will it be yummy? Definitely. It's delicious. Scrumdedly dumptious. Every single bite. They all agree that they'd eat the whole bowl solo if they could. It's really very lucky that apples taste so good. Uh-oh, we have reached the end of the story. Oh my! But don't worry, you can easily find Bastian's apple salad at storyberries.com. Hmm. Why do I think you should read this story one more time? Well, for one, Bastian, our little chef, loves preparing delicious and nutritious dishes. It promotes healthy eating. Also, this story teaches us about sharing things with family, something we must all do. Before we go, I would like to know, what yummy and healthy food do you want to share with your family? Share your story next time.